Jill, um, I was proud to be involved in the Commonwealth Games in some small part, uh, at least. Um, it, it was well and truly, um, without a shadow of a doubt, Glasgow's finest hour. It was our finest achievement, um, certainly in my uh, living memory. Uh, and it will be a hard act to follow. And the sport was absolutely uh, wonderful. And so was the cultural programme. And the cultural programme couldn't have happened without volunteers. Um, the Clydesider volunteers that played their role in the delivery of the sports programme did a fantastic uh, job. And equally, the host city uh, volunteers, who are people who uh, either live here or work here or study in our city, did an absolutely magnificent job. I met many of you uh, during uh, the games when I was going round uh, the three live sites uh, and what a wonderful experience that was. The council of course had booked the sunshine uh, <laughs> for the games, for, for, for the live sites, for the cultural programme uh, and everyone was commenting on the role played by the host city volunteers. So I want to thank you very much uh, indeed for making the games the success uh, that they were. And I think the exhibition up the stair, for those of you who haven't seen it yet, actually captures uh, the mood of the city uh, at the time. My badge says, people make Glasgow. Glasgow. And by golly, people do make Glasgow. And if, if you look at that exhibition up there, you will see images of many, many people, um, audiences coming to the, uh, the events that were on in the cultural programme. You will see images of the host city volunteers, of you yourselves. It's your exhibition after all, you guys uh, <laughs> produced the thing. All we're providing really is the venue uh, to put the exhibition uh, on. And we've got up there um, an, a, a huge big image of Clyde, the mascot, which was a, an iconic uh, image throughout uh, the games. And we've got uh, a whole host of other memorabilia. I won't spoil it for you by uh, telling you everything that's up, that's up there. But it's an absolutely um, fantastic exhibition it will run from now until August of this year. That of course is the anniversary of the closing ceremony uh, from the Games which was uh, an absolutely magnificent event. Of course the host city volunteers were featured in the uh, closing ceremony uh, as well. So I've got a whole number of people to thank uh, in closing. Uh, I want to thank the Big Lottery because they uh, provided some of the funding for the host city uh, programme along with the City Council. Uh, I want to thank all the staff of Glasgow Life and the wider council family from Land and Environmental Services, Education Services. I want to thank Scotty Dog. <laughs> Heckled many a time as a politician. Today is the first time ever that I've been heckled by a dog. Um, absolutely brilliant. The, the, the dogs played a wonderful role um, in the opening ceremony as well, you, you, you might recall. But whole host of staff from right across the council family and all our partner organisations, voluntary sector organisations, uh, other public service providers in the city, but most of all, the people of the city. That's why the badge says people make Glasgow. The people of this city embraced the games in a way that we could never have dreamed of. Absolutely never could have dreamed of. But the people I want to thank most are you, the host city volunteers. Many of you, many of you have continued to volunteer uh, since the games. You ha you, you, you've still got your uniforms, some of you. Um, I know it, you haven't handed them back. <laughs> Well, that's okay, that's absolutely okay. Many of you are volunteering across Glasgow Life in our museums and yeah. in our sports centres and in other parts uh, uh, of the council family and that's what it's all about. It's about mm -hmm. us embracing the people of Glasgow and, vo and volunteering is crucial to all the services that the council and the wider council family provide in this city. So from the bottom of my heart, thank you to each and every one of you for the magnificent role you played in delivering the best Commonwealth Games ever. Ladies and gentlemen, people make Glasgow. Yeah.